The Eastern Visayas State University is a public institution of higher education located on the island of Leyte in the Philippines. Its campuses serve 14,000 students in over 40 degree programs, with a vision to produce competent leaders providing quality education and professional training. However, as is often the case, the school's resources are limited. In 2010, the main library fiction collection totaled 153 titles, many of which were outdated and obscure, books that had been discarded by other libraries. Accordingly, Chief Librarian Erlinda Eilis and Peace Corps volunteer Mark Fulmer initiated a book acquisition project, using a website, YouTube video, and emails to solicit engaging contemporary literature at a reading level appropriate for the university's students. The response was immediate and beyond expectations. Some contributors were friends or relatives. Others were connected with schools and libraries in the United States. Still others were complete strangers who, once hearing about the project, wanted to help. By November 2011, over 500 books had been shipped in low-cost Balik Bayan boxes from California to the Philippines, with more on the way. As part of National Book Week, to promote a reading culture among Filipinos, a commemorative program was held, featuring presentations by university administrators and Peace Corps volunteers. With the generosity and kind assistance of the U.S. Peace Corps volunteer, of the Philippines, they have paved the way in improving our library by way of this acquisition book project. Books are our greatest, our great assets. They not only provide nuggets of wisdom, but they also shape and nurture the character of a person. Books are universally acknowledged as the essential tools of knowing one's ability and attaining national development and enrichment of one's life. I've started a remedial reading program there, which I use peer tutors that volunteer to come help first year high school students read. It's just, a, it's, it's buddy reading, so it's nothing formal. It's just for the students to be able to read with each other to gain more experience. Some of you are holding some of those materials. Can you tell me why I have brought what I brought today? Is anybody holding a book? Language book, Filipino, language book, dictionary. A Kindle, an electronic book. Can you stand up and show everybody what that is? In the last 20 or 30 years, all of the public libraries have also done programming, mostly for children, but also for adults, so that parents will bring their children in for activities, including music and playtime and story time. Thank <laughs> you. 